Hello and welcome back to Weeping Willow Homestead. Today I have a food pantry haul for you. Uh, this is our local small church run one. So let me show you what all we got. We got two of these um, small pizzas. I figured um, these would work really well for lunch for my kiddos one day. A bag of fully cooked chicken meatballs. These are really good. Um, these are, they're kind of like Hot Pockets, only smaller, and they're breakfast. They have eggs and cheese and ham in them. My kids really liked them. They were, they were quick and easy to throw. I just threw them in the air fryer and heated them up for breakfast. One thing of whole milk yogurt. Two things of vegan cream cheese. So we'll see, we'll have to compare that to regular cream cheese and see what it, the difference taste-wise is. A thing of low-fat cottage cheese. A thing of organic heavy whipping cream, a block of mozzarella, two things of sour cream, a thing of boneless skinless chicken breasts, and a thing of ground pork. They had quite a few of these and they're like these little poof thingies for babies. Um, my three-year-old really likes them just as much as the baby does so they're kind of nice to uh, throw in my purse and have a snack for the little kids a box of cliff bars a box of um oats and honey kind of like a granola cereal and we'll just use this on yogurt in yogurt bowls two boxes of triscuits two boxes of um like craft mac and cheese a box of the Belvita. Um, brown sugar and cinnamon biscuits. These my kids like to have as snacks. I've got some canned goods. There's peas. This is a vegan Alfredo sauce, and it's been on the shelf there for a while, um, and nobody seems to be taking it, so I figured I would give it a try. It's um, way lower in carbs than regular, so that might work for me. There's two cans of tuna and two cans of uh, chicken. Those are really nice for tuna salad and chicken salad for lunch. There's two cans of fruit cocktail, a can of chicken broth, a bottle of organic ketchup, a thing of this all-purpose seasoning. If you find this, this is really good. I've used it on all kinds of things and it's delicious. A thing of instant coffee for my husband. He's actually going on a primitive camping trip with a couple of buddies of his. And he was planning on buying this, so that worked out perfect that he ended up not needing to buy it. Um, this roasted red pepper spread, I'm not sure how to use this, if anybody knows what to use this for. It looked delicious. I love roasted red peppers. So I thought, if nothing else, I may end up putting it on, like, eggs or something like that. Um, in the past, they've had these that were asparagus, and these are artichokes, and it's basil and thyme. These are really good just dumped on a salad or um, on eggs. I got two of the Sriracha Epic Bars. These are extremely clean, really nice, um, no carbs, that kind of thing. And then this Biltong Stick, and it was mesquite barbecue flavored that sounded delicious. A pack of hot dog buns. We got four of the little tiger paws. My kids really like these. It's essentially just sugary cereal in a pack. So they get one for like a snack and that's it. We don't do cereal a whole lot. So that's kind of fun. Um, eight packs of the little animal crackers, which my one-year-old has been enjoying. A pile of various granola bars. Um, quite a few of the cliff bars. Uh, I would guess that this was a busted box. And then... Some of these, the kids really like these. Uh, two bags of the Smart Pop um, white cheddar. There's a thing of sour cream and onion twisted pretzels. And we got these last time we were there, the Snyder's rounds, and the kids really liked them. They're a, a softer pretzel, I guess would be the way to explain it. They're not as hard and crunchy. They had the diapers at the diaper pantry again, and once again, it comes with 15 diapers, a pack of wipes, and a kid's book. And then it also, in ours, has um, 
a list of local resources and that kind of thing to try it out. I got a thing of Pepsi Mango for my husband. There are 12 of these little mini bottles of water, um, which are great for in the car for the kids. Um, two bottles of orange juice, two rolls of toilet paper, some detangling spray, which is nice. My daughter and I both have really, really long hair, so it that's nice for getting knots out. A box of, or a bottle of um, probiotics, kids probiotics. Um, they had a bunch of these, and I actually just started taking these. I had picked up a bottle before, and I just started taking these, and I'm feeling a big difference in my energy. So I'm hoping that that's part of what this is. Um, I have adrenal fatigue. So uh, it was exciting to find these because these aren't, this brand is extremely good and these aren't cheap. So that's nice. A thing of the Lemon Crisp Kit Kat. My husband, I picked up one of these before and my husband takes it to work and just leaves it on his desk. And he said that his coworkers really, really liked them. Um, unsweetened applesauce cups. They didn't have a whole lot of produce this time, which was a bummer. Um, they did have strawberries, and they all look really good. This little container of snap peas and hummus. And then a bag of apples, and I just happen to be feeling around, and there's at least two or three bad apples in there. So those will go directly into the compost or out to the chickens, but the rest of it was fine. So that's everything we got this time. Um, I also got, they also have a, a clothing pantry, and if you're interested in seeing that, let me know. Um, it would be a little bit more difficult to film, but um, it's it's a classroom that they have that's full of clothes, everything from newborn to men's. They have shoes, um, even like bras and underwear and that kind of thing that they've gotten new from stores. So if you're interested in seeing that, let me know. Um, Otherwise, I probably won't film it because, like I said, it's kind of a pain to, it would be a pain to film. But I can try. So, thank you so much. Have a great day, and God bless.